Hey everyone, this is Jeremy from MyConsultantTraining.com and today I will be showing you how to use a barcode scanner with the Square app on your phone so you can uh, scan the UPC on book titles, on the books and uh, use that with the Square app to more easily bring people out at booths and events and whatnot. So if you, you know, if you have the means and the funds, Square offers a whole point of sale product you know with the iPad and a barcode scanner which I'm sure is a more seamless integration and in use but that thing's a few hundred bucks so uh, for the rest of us hustling on a budget this is a, a, a good way to go you know the the barcode scanner that we have here it's available on Amazon it's a smart and cool brand and it's less than 40 bucks so we'll put the link on the blog post for where to get that and um, so I'll be showing you today on my phone which is a Samsung Galaxy S7 Android phone um, we don't have an iPhone to demo but we do have an iPad and you know it works pretty much the same on that but if anyone needs to see a demo of how it would work on an iPad let us know in the comments and we can show that as well so the first thing we're going to do is pair the barcode scanner with the phone and it, it operates over Bluetooth so what you do is the trigger on the bottom here you'll hold it in for about eight seconds or so until that light on top starts flashing blue so now it's in pairing mode so you can let go of the trigger go over to your phone go to your Bluetooth settings um, you know, turn Bluetooth on there so you should see under available devices you'll have general Bluetooth HID barcode scanner so click that and that'll pair your phone with the barcode scanner and you'll see that it's paired once the light is blue on the barcode scanner and stops flashing so from there you can now go over to the Square app on your phone and you'll see your item list there so um, this will only work if you're using our latest um, Square book title file because we embedded the UPC into the uh, titles now so um, what's gonna happen is in the barcode with the barcode scanner when you scan the the barcode on the back it essentially will search for the um, the UPC number and that's how it's gonna find it so uh, here we go let's go back to scanner here so you'll see the single timeout and essentially shut off after a few seconds so to get it back just click once and then wait wait a couple seconds for the light to turn blue on there so then what you'll do on your phone is hit the little search button at the top there and then you'll see the cursor is active in the search all items so then I'll grab a book here hold the trigger scan the barcode so you'll see it found it farm animals so then you just click the click the title there and it'll add it to the cart if they had more than one you could just push it again and it would go in there so once you've added that just hit the X up here and then you're back at the whole list of titles there so you can hit search again and then I have all better here so it add, puts a barcode in there all better shows up sorry it's kinda hard to see hit all better now you've got all better in there so after you scan them all um, you know just hit charge and go through the regular checkout process so it's pretty easy to use works pretty fast um, you know it, it works well for us so um, again if you don't have if you haven't used our latest book title file we'll put a link to that blog post in here um, and we'll also put a link to the barcode scanner that we're using here this smart and cool barcode scanner which is available on Amazon uh, that's all I have for today if you have any questions let us know in the comments below and um, where the barcode scanner is also helping us out is inventory it makes inventory a lot faster so I'll have another video 
uh, coming up that will show how we do inventory using the barcode scanner. So that's all for now. Thanks for watching.